That's the woman we saw with Rachel's dad. Weird. Yo, Frank! It's Chloe. I don't know the secret password, man. Is the password... drugs? Christ, get your ass in here. Dude, it smells like piss in here. Shut up. You have a rough night or something? Every night's a rough night. I've got a notebook in the back somewhere. Go get it for me, would you? Who is that? Look up! God, jeez, man. Get my notebook, Price. Then we'll talk. Now I'm fetching things for Frank. How low can I go? Okay, little guy. Oh shit! Pompadou, get up here! Pompadou? You little killer. <laughs> A swingy flippy instrument of death. Is this what I think it is? Ah, shit. I'm in the red. Time to find out what Frank wants to discuss. That's an insane amount of beans. Bomb sauce. For the man who enjoys searing pain with his drive through order. Frank must be spending hundreds of dollars on this dog. I guess Frank subscribes to the hiding in plain sight philosophy of drug stashing. Part of a balanced breakfast. Poor Frank. Next time, try Ask Miss Arcadia. Rachel the therapist, but shit, the mill burned down. Jeez, that's an expensive dog. Oh man, I hope Argus and Bowser are. Okay. Is this it? Have a seat. Pompadour, huh? That's one badass name for a dog. It's French. A 
<laughs> okay. But he's not a poodle, Frank. No, he's not. But I'm gonna treat him like one. Okay. So, who was that woman? What woman? The one I saw coming out of your RV. Oh yeah, I meant to introduce you. Her name is Mind Your Own Fucking Business. Okay. Fine. Guess Rachel's dad isn't bad girls. You hear the mill burn down? Yeah. I, uh, heard some stuff about it. Crazy. My friend Damon runs the place. He lost a lot of money last night. How about you? Did you lose anything in the fire? No, but I'll probably get pulled into whatever shit Damon's dealing with right now. Lately, he's been doing some stuff that I don't like, but I don't seem to have much leverage with him like I once had. Anyway, you and I have shit to discuss. Is this about the buck 75? What? The money that I owe you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I don't give a shit about that. Wait, do you have it? Don't you have richer clients to bother? I should fucking hope so. Well, good. Because I need everything I've got. You're a pain in the ass. I've got bigger problems right now. Open my notebook. Last page. Should be some entries for a kid named Drew. You know him? <laughs> Drew North? Yeah, he's... Holy shit. That's a lot of money. Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Apparently football players eat it like candy. That's smart, I guess. It pays well? Go Bigfoots. Problem is, Drew owes a grant, and he's not answering my calls. You know what's going on with them? Uh, he's an unreliable douchebag. No, this is the first time he's done this. Kid's actually smart. Anyway, here's the job. I'm taking you to Blackwell. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Can you handle that? Yeah, of course. But what's in it for me? Idiot. You still owe me. So, if I do this, then we're good? That, and I'll do even better. I'll give you a 10% cut of the money. Okay. Yeah, sure. I'll do it. What's the matter? It might be a little tough. I, I'm not supposed to be at Blackwell. I... got expelled... this morning. Congratulations. Still easier for you to go on campus than for me. If you can't even do this price... A hundred dollars closer to leaving Arcadia Bay. With a bit of cash and the truck fixed, Rachel and I could really do it. We could leave for good. I'll do it. Good deal. be back this soon. Well, here goes nothing. Better hurry up and get
into the dorms. What would I buy if I had enough money to build a whole dorm? Probably not a dorm. Locked. <laughs> Figures. Looks like my options are become a master lock picker or swipe someone's keys. Hey, Steph. Whoa. Hey, Calamastia. Your shirt looks like the tea leaves they used to tell people's fortunes. How's my future looking? Bright and sunny. Surprised to see me on parole? I told you Wells was out to get you. That text was a rare courtesy, by the way. I don't normally get involved in other people's dumb decisions. Thanks for trying, but skipping yesterday was totally worth it. Skipping with Rachel Amber does have an appeal. Well, yeah. So, what are you doing here? Uh, I figured I'd see the Tempest. For real? You? Yeah, I know. It's not really my thing. Uh, <laughs> kinda hoping it's a shit show. What the hell? I'm the stage manager. Oh, I think I knew that. My bad. You better mean it. Honestly, the show's really good. It's worth seeing. I'm sure it is. Obviously, Rachel's fantastic, but everyone else is pretty impressive, too. You get to see a totally different side of everyone, especially the guys. Okay. I'm intrigued. Go on. Like, Hayden's so annoying, but when he puts on that crown, he's actually very princely. And Nathan is Caliban? <laughs> There's so much depth there. Right. Depth. Yeah, well, good luck with all of that. <laughs> Maybe I'll see you later. Oh, hey. I wanted to ask you something. Shoot. I've been planning to make a move on Rachel, but not if you two were together. Make a move? So, are you? Uh... I mean, that's Rachel's business. Or maybe yours and Rachel's business. But if you feel comfortable telling me... I'm... Uh, I, I don't know. It's... it's... confusing. <sighs> yeah, I, I can imagine. You ever want to talk to me, Chloe? You know you can, right? I'll see you later, Steph. Have fun storming the castle. Why, yes. Chloe, of course you may look through that. Steph's really good at creating fantasy worlds. Bingo. If only those keys were unsupervised. What's Samuel working on? Uh, the sprinklers?
<sighs> if Samuel's working on the sprinklers, some damage here might get his attention. But Evan is right there. That bird is really pretty. I can see why Evan would follow it around all day. Shh. What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be at home thinking over your endless list of questionable decisions? Dude, why do you care about my questionable decisions? It offends me when intelligence is wasted. <laughs> Did Evan just call me intelligent? Damn straight. Wow. Evan looks... really ridiculous. Chloe? Uh-huh? I've learned something about myself recently. Something that I think you might understand. I've learned that if I'm passionate about something, it's probably the right thing to care about. For example, I've been trying to get the students and administration interested in forest fire prevention. That is kind of an odd topic to focus on. People are so eager to pass on responsibility to anyone else so that they can live comfortable, unworried, and ultimately meaningless lives. You see what happened? <laughs> Looks like you were right. <laughs> Go, Evan. You're a hero of the people. I know you feel like I do. A about different things, I'm sure. But you only give a shit about what you give a shit about. I like that. A anyway, you're not supposed to be here. You should leave. Hey! Shit! I wanted you to go the other way. Like, as far as possible, the other way. Drew's room definitely isn't this way. <laughs> what are the chances that... 200 years ago, some teenager got in trouble for carving faces all over the thing. Time for a fresh start. Here we go. Perfect. You're welcome. Awesome. Now I just have to wait for Samuel to turn on the... <laughs> that works. Sorry, Samuel. All right, time to find Drew's room. No time like the present. Chloe? 
<laughs> hey, Skip. How's it going? Not that it isn't great to see you and all, but what are you doing here? Didn't you just get expelled? Relax. I'm just uh, visiting a friend. I, I can't... I, I really can't just let you go in. I'm going inside, dude. You're just gonna have to let this slide. I don't think I can. In fact, I think I have to ask you to state your official business or else vacate Blackwell property. I hate to do this to Skip, but I've got to get inside. Maybe if I make him really uncomfortable, he'll feel guilty and let me pass. What's my official business? Women's business, Skip. As in, my uterus? I need to use the restroom. Glad you asked. What? No. No, it's my job to ask, Chloe. Your job is creepy, then. Which makes you... Kind of a creeper. Oh, it's not like that. Do you know what Wells would do to me if I didn't, you know, patrol? You know Wells doesn't really respect you, right? You're just a, a rent-a-cop who needs a haircut. I thought we were friends. Where is this coming from? I thought we were friends, too, but when the man comes down on you, you come down on me. Is that it? Look, look, look! I am really sorry, Chloe. I'm just so confused right now. You're... you're sorry? Y you just looked at my tits. You, you did. You stared right at them. Oh! Shit. I, I don't know what to do. Seriously, my uterus is on fire, dude. W what? Is that, uh, descriptive enough? I don't want to know about- En fuego utero, Skip. En fuego utero. I don't, I don't know what to say. I'm so sorry. Matthews. <sighs> I'm here? I've gotten reports of an unknown vehicle in the parking lot. Oh, thank God. Oh, I'm on it. I won't tell Wells. Do what you have to do, okay? I won't tell anyone. All right, which one is Drew's room? Guess I'll never see my name on one of these. I wouldn't have made it to senior year anyway. Yeah, uh, definitely Drew's room. I should probably just get the money.
Good. <laughs> Drew's not here. Okay, <laughs> if I were Drew, where would I hide my money? <sighs> Is the money in there? Oh, right. Guess I have to crack a four-digit code. Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? No wonder you're so into football. Plenty of possible combinations here. Plenty of possible combinations here. I didn't realize Drew was this good at sports. I bet he can't wait to get out of Arcadia Bay. Frank wasn't lying. Looks like Drew sells happy pills to his fellow meatheads. So many folks are shit out of luck around here. At least Drew has some prospects. Mikey's figures. <laughs> Playing that game yesterday was actually fun. Looks like Mikey's been staying here with Drew. A lot of numbers on here. Would Drew really use something like this for a lock combo? Damn it. Wrong numbers. <laughs> they look so happy. Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? No wonder you're so into football. Damn it. Wrong numbers. Plenty of possible combinations here. Damn it. Wrong numbers. Damn it. Wrong numbers. Hmm. 
I wonder exactly how important 516 is to Drew. Might actually need some help with this one. One, two, two, seven. Ugh, worth a shot. Yes! This is kind of fun. Ah. Oh. Did little Drew beat you up, too? <sighs> Jackpot. I'm kind of good at this. Okay, got the money. Time to bust out of here. <laughs> 